feel a little off this morning. Last night I was doing a lot of coughing. It is stay inside advisory because of the smoke. The official GDT goes this way and I am backtracking for my alternative. My plan was to take this hiking trail to the lodge. I don't feel the best. So even though it's longer, I'm gonna make the morning a little bit gentler by walking up the road. Slow ride, take it easy. Super quiet and kind of relaxing. Even though it's coming from a drainage pipe under the road, look how pretty that blue is. My I am over halfway done the road walk and um, it seems to be less smoky since I've started climbing up. I cut, my throat feels uh, a lot better. I, I saw all these cars as I was walking up. Canoe rental area. They have some info here. Use the washroom. Guess it is a little hard to pee from a canoe. More turquoise than emerald. The roofs match the color of the lake. Welcome to Emerald Lake Live. So I'm gonna chill in this nice lounge until the bar opens for lunch. I feel so fancy and posh in the lounge of this lodge, uh, but at least I'm not super dirty. I only spent one night in the woods and my hair still smells like shampoo. I ordered a coffee. That's a lot of coffee. A beer. Uh, this is of uh, White Tooth that I'm visiting Golden. They're Icefields Pale Ale, which I really liked. Great. And this is a shout out to Albert. Albert, thanks for the beer. Cheers. My lunch is a bison burger and coconut squash soup. Decided to try the ale. This is um, tall timber from Brewery Mount Burnie in Revelstoke. And a shout out to Oliver. Oliver, thanks for the beer. It's super multi tasting. It's okay. Decided to go for a salted caramel espresso martini. Oh, hiking's going to be fun later today. I'll be regretting all this alcohol later on the climb. But right now, totally enjoying myself. Smoke has been clearing a bit. And the water is unbelievable. There was just a traffic jam over there to get a selfie at the lake. Two coffees for the price of two coffees. Now, if it was two beers for the price of two beers. If I had big bucks, I would have stayed here instead of camping by the river. But <laughs> camping by the river wasn't so bad. Eight kilometers. This area is hot, hot, hot for fossils. Fossil fossils everywhere. In the Burgess Shale area, you can see it through the hazy smoke stuff. And this is the little beach to see so many different families of all different cultures out and enjoying this wild space. There's no fee to park your car here, so you don't need to stay at the lodge or eat at the lodge. You can just bring your own picnic and your own canoe and dunk into Emerald Lake. It's July, so no problemo. The lodge has the best staff ever, especially my waiter, Gabriel, from Ottawa. Diamonds are forever. Great James Bond film. Because I was born in May. It's my birthstone. A little disappointed the water's not as green as I would like it to be. The end of the lake. I'm ready for a climb. Bring on the climb. I've got beer, coffee, and burger power in me. Yo, yo ho. Is it up there? Wow, that seems really high. Caution. Flooding on trail. Uh, I don't want wet feet today. Wait, is this the area with the flooding? Because I think they need to take down that sign. I don't think this snowy area is my pass. I think my pass is through the forest straight ahead. I shouldn't have made fun of that sign. Because we do got some flooded trail. 
Joke's on me. Tried to reposition the log and I have one wet foot because it did a little roll. Actually, I don't, I don't even think I can cross dry coming up. There's a, a lot more water flowing anyways. So just embrace the wet and bomb straight through. Yo, what side of uh, this river am I supposed to be on? I don't even know. Whoa, 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 waterfall, waterfall. And I see pink flagging, so I gotta cross the river. Yo, yo ho. Walking beside the whoa, 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 waterfall, waterfall. Well, guess that means my flooding days are over. Two wet feet climbing up. I thought this was the trail and I'm like, okay, okay. And then I look, I'm like, yeah, switchbacks. Oh God, feels like I've been smoking 10 packs of cigarettes coming up here. Ugh. My throat feels like, ugh. My haze a haze of you. See the lake in the distance. that waterfall. I was wondering where I was heading. Waterfall keeps getting higher and higher as I climb up. Burgess Pass is this way. Point seven to Yoho Lake. A big payoff with gaining elevation is the wildflowers. Three privies? <laughs> That's odd. Three. Must be a poop hot spot. I have arrived at Yo Ho Ho Lake. Nice blue color. Actually, it's this this lake is more green than Emerald Lake. There is a plaque on a cairn here that says that the first camp at Yo Ho Lake was held in 1906. It's not too bad, especially since there's a direct path to the privy for the morning. Got my shirt drying out, my quilt drying out. <laughs> there's not much sun. I don't know how dry it's going to get. Tent has been set up. I attempted to swim the water. Did not get very far. <laughs> I just didn't want to get my clothes wet. It's six o'clock. And there's not enough sun and I don't want to be wearing wet clothes because I'm going to have a very, very early start tomorrow. My black bag is up in the bear hang. I am tired. I'm going to relax in my tent. 7.30. 7.30.